Hello everyone, Gavilon here with the team for the Fell Angel Shinryu. Got Vaughn, Kor, and Aerith. And yeah, this is pretty much just a repeat of Vaughn's intersecting wills. You know, there are a few things different. Uh, the boss really wants to use ice and water magic. Uh, the background is different. Not that that really makes a difference. Um, boss makes itself immune to launches at 30% on the force gauge. Oh, the boss, I feel like the gauge charging up is faster than in Vaughn's will. I think that sums it up. Yeah, unfortunately the strategy I found here that got me through it was uh, just kind of let the boss do its thing, kind of weather that storm and uh, you know, see wherever. Yeah, basically just live through its force time, then counterattack with our own force time. That's what I've been doing. It's been working all right so far. Yeah, so 30% non water and. Uh, Non water and ice damage that isn't doing weakness damage isn't really gonna be doing a whole lot. That's fine, we don't we don't need that. I'm just hard relying on the force time. Do another red spiral. Sixty percent. Mm. I'll do this for a little bit of damage. Enemies gauge is at sixty-four. Yeah, so I'm gonna keep tossing that oath of absolute defense on Aerith because uh, basically the boss really punches being broken, so I'm just trying to circumvent that. Can do that. Okay, skill two to inflict blind. Okay, let me see. Okay, it's risky, but I'm just gonna do. Okay, wait, I'm gonna check. Oath. Missed. Okay. Yeah, I'll go for it. So it's really important that she does this attack before the blind moves off. Thank you. Okay. Nobody on the team can be broken. We just gotta hope. It missed, like, one person, but that's the best-case scenario right there. So, what she's gonna do here is hit us with a very powerful Brave attack. That is Holy Joe Plus. It has no HP attack to it. Oh, tied to it. But if she breaks it, uh, she's basically just gonna wipe the team. But the thing is, is that Core and Aerith can't be broken because of Core. Vaughn has his missed. And, uh... Yeah, I want to say that's all that's going on here. Let's get some damage in.
Okay, so we can do that. It's really important that I get this onto Aerith, so I keep putting that on her. And Vaughn is gonna. I'll hit him with a skill one. Okay, I want to say this is a threshold. I don't know what it's going to do. Debuffs. No renew, thank God. So I got a free skill. Oh, but we are under turn rate now. So I'm gonna do a healing wind. Pray the Cetra. That's the case, I'll just do another one of these. Oh yeah, Vaughn is sure in danger. <laughs> okay, free skill. going to cause it to renew, which means we got to hit it with a boatload of HP attacks, or we elemental weakness attacks. Unfortunately, that's going to have to be, um, I want to say it's 10 before its next turn, so that was one, oh boy, two, Think about this. So if I did that cycle two times, plus I think I had Reaper's Gale charged up, quartered it. Okay, so I think I'm at seven. This should be all well, minus one just to be safe. So this is seven. Of course, next attack would be eight. Aerith is still enchanted. Okay, I should be good to go. Oath of Absolute Defense. Yes. Okay. I should still be good to go, right, game? Okay, I'm gonna do this just to be safe. Okay, so I would have been good. But uh, I'd rather be safe than lose this footage. Okay, so I'm guessing I need to use skill too. Oh, that's water. Uh, smack it on Earth.
normal field. Gage is charging up, which got to say, pretty good news on my end, actually. Water mist. Eh. Yeah, keep at it. Oh, does he still have mist? He does not. Okay, uh, he has blink though. Okay, so our damage is about to take a dive. Um, she has the oath. Okay, we're in force time. Oh, he's gonna want mist. I don't want to go too crazy on the damage. Eh, actually, he's not going to deal 3%. This thing is a tank. Okay, so that's going to be two turns. One, two, three, force goes away there. Okay, party's about to get brave for now. Bond's force here. Aaron two turns. I want her to stay there. That one turn buff. Please be the water. Please tell me you have a lot of turns to seal evil. Oh, if I could be so lucky. That's eh, damage loss by a little bit. So I'm going to pass this on to Vaughn. Eric should be safe thanks to Vaughn's BT effect. And it is... Almost go time. That's not a renew, is it?
All right, let's see what happens. Debuff, just debuff, just debuff. Oh, thank you, God. Okay, so I don't gotta worry about a summon phase here. Oh, hello, Aerith, in your two turns. So, free skill. Free skill. Not free skill. While also renewing seal evil at the same time. Okay, let's go now. Okay, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna skill one. And let's rip off this band aid. Because it unfortunately does not contribute to the force bonus. to recover. Yeah, a lot of good that's going to do her. Okay, we got four attacks, 28 HP. Okay, yeah, I'm liking these odds. Oh yeah, she is toast. Wonder if I'm not gonna see overkill. She has a stupid amount of life. Finally. You know, I feel like that didn't take... Uh, yeah, I feel like that didn't take as long as I thought it was going to. Please don't be another 45 minute video. My heart can't take it. Okay, but that does it for this. Next is Machina? I don't know. Hopefully I get to use Rydia there. I wanted to, but... This boss doesn't play too nice with off-turn teams. Probably possible, but I'm not the one to do it. Oh well. Goodbye for now.